maybe present. Hello, YouTube friends. This is Richard Maybe with Richard Maybe Presents. Um, and uh, start of a new week. I um, found uh, an old 8mm uh, film that my dad had filmed in the summer. I figure it was the summer of 1957. And uh, I was three years old. And uh, we lived on uh, Hazel Street in Clifton, New Jersey. And the home was a duplex home. And uh, it wasn't necessarily like, um, well, it was like downstairs and upstairs. And on the second floor was the Washington family. And they had a little boy too. His name was Robert, Robert Washington. And uh, mom had shared this with me um, about a year before she passed. So the boy's name was Robert Washington. And uh, uh, it's a very short clip. And we're riding our tricycles together. And then also uh, these little pedal cars that we had in our backyard. And I often wondered what happened to Robert Washington. When we moved from Florida, uh, wow, wow, subconscious slip there. Wow. We moved from uh, Clifton, New Jersey uh, on Hazel Street in uh, just that uh, kind of like that late fall of um, 57. So, um, yeah, um, I never saw Robert Washington again. And it's funny because I remember, they say you don't remember, they say you don't remember before you're five years old, don't remember things. But I do remember Robert Washington because we played every day. I, I, I did not go to um, daycare or something like that. My mom was a stay-at-home mom. So I remember he was my only friend, um, you know, um, while we lived at Hazel Street. He was my only friend. And we would just play in the yard for hours and hours, just all day long, just... I had no other friend. He was my only friend. And then uh, when we moved from Hazel Street, I never saw him again. And I often wonder, so I said, well, why not? Why not uh, talk about it on, on my YouTube show? Because someone out there, Robert Washington now would be 70 years old. Um, and you know, maybe someone is watching my YouTube. Is I know, or Robert Washington himself is watching the show. Who knows, you know? So, um, yeah, it's one of those things. So, um, without further ado, we'll take a, a look-see at this short film clip that my dad filmed with his 8 millimeter camera back in the summer of 1957. So without further ado, here we go. So YouTube friends, this is an old eight millimeter film that my dad had filmed uh, around the summer of 1956. And uh, or it might have been the summer of 1957. And I was three years old at the time. And this is me right here. Wait, this is Robert, my friend Robert Washington. And this is me. This is me right here. And this is Robert Washington right here. Uh, we lived on Hazel Street in Clifton, New Jersey. And uh, I always wondered what happened to Robert Washington. We moved away. Uh, I guess I was about three years, three or four years old when we moved away from Hazel Street, Clifton. But it was a duplex. And uh, there we are. So, YouTube friends, there you have it. A short clip uh, 
eight millimeter home movie that my dad filmed in the summer of 1957. Um, it was shortly thereafter, um, in the in the autumn, in the early autumn of 1957, that we moved out of uh, Hazel Street in Clifton, New Jersey, and I was never to see Robert Washington ever again. And it's kind of strange, you know, that he, when I was three years old, um, he was my only friend, you know, he was my only friend. And uh, I didn't go to preschool or anything like that. My mom was a stay at home mom. And uh, uh, my sister wasn't born yet. So Robert Washington was my only friend. He was my only friend. And we would play from sunrise, probably to sunset in the summertime, or all the time. We didn't, we didn't, you know, we'd have to go to school, three years old, you know. And I said, I, I, at 70 years old, and I've got all these things wrong in my heart, got this aortic aneurysm thing. And I said, you know, why not do a show of whatever happened to Robert Washington? And maybe... Robert Washington's watching the show. That would be so incredible. Or else someone watching the show knows Robert Washington. He would be 70 years old. And when in 1957, he lived on Hazel Street in Clifton, New Jersey. So who knows? You know, if you know, if you are Robert Washington <laughs> and 70 years old and from Clifton, New Jersey, or if you know of a Robert Washington who's 70 years old and grew up in, in in early childhood in Clifton, New Jersey, please put it down in the comments. Please put it down in the comments. That would be so cool. So I'm going to close. So, oh, look, Homeward Angel. My old, uh, my good friend, Stuart, whom I've known since first grade, sent me a copy of this for my birthday. And I'm almost at the halfway point. <laughs> this is the, of course, the front of the book. And I'm almost at the halfway point. But I'm, um, Wolf, Thomas Wolf, reading Thomas Wolf, you kind of nurture it. You know, you just, you don't, it's, you don't speed read Thomas Wolf. You just kind of nurture it. And sometimes I'll come to a paragraph and I'll read the paragraph five or six times just to get that. That essence, that that flavor, that truth, that um, the 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 spirit of what Thomas Wolfe is writing about, and uh, this is my single favorite novel. I love this novel. I think this is the greatest novel ever written. So I'm going to close. So um, stay happy, stay positive, and. Stay healthy. <laughs> this is Richard Mabey. Signing off. Mm -hmm.